Hello and welcome to this tutorial of Odoo WooCommerce Connector by Emipro. In this video, I'll show you how to create product categories, product tags and coupons and how to export them to WooCommerce. For that, first we will go to WooCommerce and under the product section, you can see product tags, product categories and coupons. So first we will go to product categories. As you can see, there are already three categories listed over here. That's men's shirts and t-shirts. And shirts and t-shirts have the parent category as men. So we will click, quickly create a new category. Dresses. The instance will be UK. And uh, I want to create a new parent category for dresses. So I'll go to create and edit. And uh, create a new pattern category women the instance will remain UK no pattern category for this I'll click on save and I'll click on save again as you can see as you can see uh, we already have women and uh, dresses added to the product categories I'll quickly create one more that's jeans Select the instance as UK and parent category, I'll set it as women. We'll click on save. Go to product categories. So six categories here, out of which two are parent categories, that is men and women. And under the parent category men, we have shirts and t-shirts. And under the parent category women, we have dresses and jeans. After this, we will create product tags. We already have two product tags created over here. That's men and red. I'll click on create and uh, create a new product tag. That's women instance UK and click on save. Again, a new product tag black instance UK and click on save. So we have four product tags over here we created two new product tags and we can see all the four product tags over here and after this we will create a coupon for that we'll go to coupons and uh, there are no coupons right now so we'll create a new one click on create so what coupon code do you want to set for this particular coupon whenever a customer enters this particular coupon code they'll get the discount so I'll set the coupon code as 10% uh, off, something like this. Instance as UK. I can provide any description if I, if I want. Now the discount type can be cart discount. You can provide some amount off on the entire cart or you can provide some percentage off on the entire cart or the product discount or product percentage discount. I'll select a uh, cart percentage discount and I'm gonna provide 10% discount you can allow free shipping on this discount code by checking here if you want to set the expiry date of this coupon you can select the date from here now there are various customizations that you can do with this coupon code uh, as you can see maximum and minimum spend for individual use if you want to uh, include or exclude a set of products you can do it here or if you want to include or exclude a set of product categories you can do it from here uh, you can also set usage limit like usage limit per coupon or usage limit per user so you can explore all these uh, options and select whatever is relevant to you uh, i'll save this coupon and uh, as you can see we have already created a new coupon so we have successfully created uh, product categories, product tags and product coupons and now we will see how we can export them to WooCommerce storefront. First we will export product categories. For that I'll go to product categories. Notice that uh, none of these categories are exported to WooCommerce. So what I'll do is I'll select three of them, men, shirts and t-shirts. Now there are multiple ways in which you can export product categories to WooCommerce. Uh, I'll show you the first method. But uh, before I export these three categories to WooCommerce, uh, let me uh, show you the WooCommerce dashboard. And uh, uh, I'll go down to products and categories. Look at this page. There are no categories right now. So when I uh, refresh, 
this page after exporting the categories our categories should appear on this page similarly uh, no tags are also available over here and uh, what about coupons go to WooCommerce coupons and no coupons are also available over here so I'll just open the products and categories page over here and go back to Odoo so I want to export these three categories it's very simple I selected them and over here I can see this button action and here export product categories it's as simple as this here it says a message that I should click on export product categories and it will export these product categories along with its parent categories so in my selection I have one parent category that is men and two child categories that is t-shirts and shirts so I'll click on export product categories and here it shows that they are exported in Woo I'll go to WooCommerce and I'll refresh this page and we have it here all the three selected categories are appearing in WooCommerce they're exported there is one more method to do this I'll go back to Odoo and uh, with the same method that I used earlier uh, we can export product tags as well I can select the product tags and uh, select this option but I won't do that the same thing applies to coupons I can select this and export coupons but I won't do that uh, what we will do is we'll try another method for that I will click on WooCommerce that will open up WooCommerce dashboard now this is a very exciting place actually uh, with the help of Odoo WooCommerce connector you can connect multiple WooCommerce instances uh, with Odoo and if you do so all the instances will appear on dashboard right now I've just uh, created one instance so it is appearing here and you can see all the details regarding that instance on the screen so it is showing me zero products coupons that's because I haven't performed any kind of operations on this uh, particular instance when I click on more it will show me details even further so regarding the products how many products are exported how many are ready to export how many are published unpublished regarding the sales like sales order or sales analysis about delivery invoices so there are multiple options I can get the entire view of the instance from here on the small screen so uh, from this screen itself we can perform various export operations so I'll show you uh, what is the other way in which you can export product categories product tags and coupons for that on this screen click on perform operation and then next screen will open up and that select ERP to woo and under under that you'll be able to see coupons categories and tags so if you select export coupons export product category and export product tags with just one single click all the product categories that we have created all the product tags that we have created and the coupon that we have created will be exported to WooCommerce just with a single flick I'll show you how I'll click on execute it will just take a couple of seconds and we are done so let us go to WooCommerce dashboard and uh, I'll first refresh this products category page where three more categories should be added I'll refresh and yes the three more categories are added we'll also check tags so under products we'll go to tags and uh, all four tags are also exported and what about coupons I'll go to WooCommerce coupons and we have successfully exported the coupon as well thank you for watching this video I hope the video was helpful any pro specializes in providing customization consultancy and support for any and all services related to Odoo so feel free to contact us on www.emiflowtechnologies.com.